Hey everybody, welcome back. Today we're watching Society of the Snow. Roll tape. Oh, I have such a fear of flying and I could never imagine crashing. I could never imagine crashing here. It's so beautiful though. El 13 de octubre de 1972, un avión uruguayo se estrelló en la cordillera de los Andes. A bordo viajábamos 40 pasajeros y 5 tripulantes. Wow. Look at this footage. Dicen que fue una tragedia. Otros hablan de un milagro. Oh, yeah, I'd call it both. ¿Qué pasó realmente? ¿Qué pasa cuando el mundo te abandona? Cuando no tenés ropa y te estás congelando. Cuando no tenés comida y te estás muriendo. La respuesta está en la montaña. Wow, what an amazing introduction. It's so haunting, terrifying. Oh, the editing already in this. <laughs> Dale, muchachos, vamos arriba que hay que llenar la mitad del avión todavía. Daniel, tus primos vienen. Sí, estamos, los cuatro adentro. Lo de la barra. Oh, uh. ¿Alguna más, muchachos? Gastón, ¿están tus amigos? Ya lo comencé a todos. Pancho, para el humo. Anunciamos muerte. You really gotta get the note to her. Oh, Numa's a guy. Santiago de Chile, 45 dólares. ¿Cuándo vas a encontrar un pasaje más barato? Nunca. <risa> en la vida. ¿Tienes un buen argumento para convencerte? A ver. Yo quiero ir con vos. En un par de meses te vas a recibir. Vas a empezar a trabajar sin parar. ¿Te pusiste a pensar que este puede ser el último viaje que podemos hacer juntos? Oh, so they're going on a trip. It's not like a sports trip. Champ. Oh, my name's Champ. Oh. Uh. Iniciando este fin de semana largo de cuatro días con previsión de sol y clima templado para que la pasen muy muy bien. The skies are looking good right now. Francisco Aval, Pancho. Adiós. Oh, he's saying goodbye to his family. Oh, it's him and his wife going. Oh, good lord. Oh. ¿Sentiste que hizo clip? Sí, está hecha. I wonder if they're going to show that picture at Me llamo Numa Turcati. Tengo 24 años. You're so young. Miro a mi alrededor y no conozco a casi nadie. Pero a la vez todo me resulta familiar. La mayoría son jóvenes como yo, criados con cariño en casa cerca del mar. Para algunos de ellos, este es el primer viaje lejos de su hogar. I remember going to the airport every time my family would come into Canada or leave. It was like everyone going to say goodbye or welcome them home. It was awesome. Always very emotional. Wow. So so incredible. Oh, they're all such little babies. It's the start of some turbulence. Los vientos cálidos del campo argentino chocan contra el viento frío de la montaña y genera un efecto de succión. Nah, no estás jodiendo. Por eso las turbulencias. Maybe don't watch this movie before you have to go on a flight. Por favor, abróchense los cinturones. En unos minutos estamos aterrizando en Santiago de Chile. Remember when he can smoke on planes? That was crazy. Oh, is he the only one that's a bit worried? Oh, they're so close to the mountain. Oh my God. Don't talk like that. Wow. The way they're shooting this is incredible. Oh, oh, that was a big drop. Yeah, I'm scared. Oh my god. That wing's gonna come off, isn't it? Oh, they hit some really rough weather. Oh my gosh, they can see into the cockpit. Whoa. Oh, it's clear now though, but what? Oh, they're starting to pray. We oh, weren't able to pull up fast enough. God, they're all crushing each other. Oh God. Oh no. <gasps> oh God. Oh my good Lord. Oh. oh. I mean, if you're someone who's lucky to survive, you're probably not in good shape. Oh, his blood. Is he upside down? 
Oh, he's upside down. Ah. Oh God, you must be in so much shock. Oh no. Oh, thank God. Thank God. <laughs> Holy shit. Oh God. He had to do it though. It's absolute chaos. Day one, October 13th, 1972. Oh my gosh. I don't even know how long they survived here. <laughs> Trying to get him to teach him. Oh my God. Oh, they, he's letting them know. It's so cold there. He stayed there with him while he died. La noche cae como una emboscada. En pocos minutos la temperatura baja a 30 oh, grados. God. Probably the most pitch black place. Si no nos mató el avión, nos va a matar el frío. Yeah, yeah, the cold is your number one enemy here. Vivos y muertos, mezclados. That's how cold it is, my God. Así pasamos la noche. Nadie se duerme, se van a congelar. Gritan los heridos. Oh, my God. Ahora sale. Yeah, because you'd be so cold. You would just fall asleep if you died with hypothermia. Oh, no. Oh, he didn't make it through the night. No. Oh, my God. What would you do? That was probably the longest night of their life. It's so incredibly beautiful, but not seeing it like this. You'd feel so alone. No one would know where you were. It'd be quite bright, especially with the, the reflection of the sun on the on the, all the snow. They seem like they're a bunch of really smart kids, though. Oh, yeah, you gotta get working. Oh. Keep them warm in the sun. I mean, you don't want to eat snow because that can cause hypothermia, I believe, in your body. But I guess you could suck on it. Oh. Oh. Very small ration. Oh, God, they're so hopeful for help. This would be so devastating. But they're being so kind and so sweet with everybody. Oh, age 43. Oh, they're saying all the people that passed away in their ages. Oh, so many people. It'd be luck that you survived. You have to savor every single bite. Did they hear a plane? They're gonna miss them for sure. Day two, October 14th. I hope this doesn't become like a Lord of the Flies thing and they all like get mad at each other and stuff. I hope they can stay together because it would be so challenging. Mm -hmm. Look through all the luggage. Nobody, you guys can make it. Small sips. We'll have to know that something happened because they never arrived. Fito Strauch no es tan optimista como Marcelo. Es un hombre sensato. Jamás le llevaría la contra el capitán, pero no le gusta lo que ve. Es un lugar donde vivir es imposible. Lo extraño acá somos nosotros. Wow, the stars. That's a caveat. You're in hell, but it's absolutely so beautiful there. Oh no. ¿Qué pasó? Chocamos contra la montaña. <laughs> oh, he's going to his sister. I'd want to be with my brother too. ¿Dónde está mamá? Tu mamá murió en Andor. Oh, their poor father. 
Oh, it was only supposed to be a short trip. ¿Hace cuánto tiempo estamos acá? Tres días. ¿No vieron? No. Tell him. Oh, okay. He's melting the snow for water. There you go, buddy. Oh, it's gonna take a while. That's smart, though. You have to do that. Oh, are they making a sign with the suitcases for planes? I just, oh God, they're gonna hit a freaking storm and all that's gonna get covered. <sighs> oh my God, they are looking for them. Oh, this is so smart. How do they not see them? lo que me comería yo, un chivito del bar a Rosena. Oh. Oh. Qué buenas milanesas, el tamaño de las milanesas de la mascota. Con papas fritas. You love french fries? Le han haber tirado algo de comida del avión, ¿no? Imagínate que te dan un paquete así, se hunde en la nieve, no lo vemos nunca más. Oh, that's, that's right, because it'd be so heavy. Traigan a los heridos. Oh, they're making a net. Oh, they've made him a cot. Oh my God, your hope would just be like wavering because you'd be like, yes. And then it would be so sad because you'd be like, why haven't they found us? Seguramente están buscando en otra zona. Si nos siguen buscando, es que no nos vienen. Van a venir. They're, they just aren't seeing them because they're probably like, they probably went off route. So they're probably flying the route and they don't see them crashed because he said that they had passed Kiriko. You have to keep hoping. That's the only thing that keep, can keep you alive. Three minutes sin respirar, three days sin consumir agua, and three semanas sin comer. If I live three days sin comer, I'm going to die of hunger. We're in the frío, in the altura. We're consuming three or four times more calories. Ah. Hablo de las baterías. Iban en la cola del avión. Para mí, hay que subir a buscarlas allá donde chocamos. Oh my God. I mean, they're young and still fit, bit banged up. Look, I was like, yeah, they don't have any, have any supplies, but this, they're so smart. But what if they're there for so long and then winter comes? Oh, they'd be so tired. They're sending up a lot of them, hiking up the trail where the plane slid down. Oh, they're just spending so much of their energy. <laughs> yeah. What does he see? Yeah, you know, see. Oh, oh, it just probably looks like another rock. Oh no, they're covered. Oh, an avalanche. Oh no. Oh no, there's just gonna be. Oh no. Are they gonna have to move and leave the plane? Ya van seis días sin comer. Anoche repartimos lo último que nos quedaba. Un paquete de galletitas. Ya no hay más. I guess they're in a very vulnerable area for avalanches. Where are you going? What's in the rock? As he was trying to scavenge for something. Oh! Is that like a, a piece of his bone sticking out? Or is it a scab? Oh! Oh, God. Carlito se acercó para contarme. Dice que Nando se está volviendo loco. Que anoche se le acercó para decirle que no se va a morir de hambre. No voy a morir. Que si hace falta se come los cuerpos. Si hace falta se come. Yo le respondí que no tenemos otro camino. What other choice do you have to survive? That'd be such a difficult decision. El perro tardío se que comer. The PTSD you would have. Marcelo, no vienen. Nos estamos muriendo de hambre. Si no comemos, nos vamos a morir. ¿Comer qué? No se está loco, Roberto. Afuera de comida. It's gonna split them apart. Roberto tiene razón, estamos hablando de Marcelo. Y si en dos días aparece el rescate, ¿qué vamos a hacer, Fito? ¿Qué va a pasar con nosotros? Dios nos va a perdonar. Dios no... Dios no tiene nada que ver con esto. Acá nos trajo la suerte. Es solo carne. Es gente que queremos, Arturo. ¿Y cómo se corta un cuerpo? How could you do it? Yo. <gasps> Yo lo hago. Oh my God. Yo no voy a comer. Nosotros no podemos hacer eso. It's life or death. Legal comer un muerto. No vamos a ir presos si lo hacemos. 
Oh my gosh, there's like so many moral questions. Agarrar y usar un cuerpo sin su consentimiento. Que comer, no? no tenemos ese derecho. ¿Y yo no tengo derecho a hacer todo lo que pueda para poder vivir? ¿Quién me va a sacar ese derecho? Oh my gosh. You'd have to bargain with yourself, you know? Like they sacrifice themselves to help us survive, you know? Like I don't know, it'd be so hard, but you you would want to live. Oh god. I sit on each side. I don't know if I could do it, but I'd want to survive. Oh, they're still searching through people's stuff in case they miss something. Try to eat the leather from the shoe. Oh, are you making something to use? Oh, they're oh they're just eating whatever. Oh no. Oh, I just lost so much weight. What would make you change your mind? Not wanting to die. Oh, I just feel for them because the decision would be so hard. Oh no, 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 no. Oh. Susi, Susi, respira. No, no. Gustavo! Gustavo, ayúdame, por favor. I mean, I wouldn't eat my sister or my brother, you know? Like, I honestly, like, I would rather have died in the crash than have to make this decision. Oh, she was only 20. Oh. Estamos en un lugar divino, todo cerrado por montañas. Estamos todos muy bien. Somos en el momento 27 los vivos. Hoy se murió la hermana de Nando Parrado. Los extraño mucho. Y constantemente le pido a Dios que por lo menos me deje verlos un día más. Think it would make your faith stronger or do the opposite. Oh. Esto es un cementerio. Yo no me voy a quedar acá. Oh, are you gonna start hiking out with nothing? Day nine, October 21st. Oh, they've made it a long time. That would be a long time. Si muero, les doy permiso para alimentarse de mi cuerpo. <gasps> wow. Así siguen viviendo. Yo doy mi consentimiento también. Y yo el mío. <gasps> yo también les doy mi permiso. Oh, I'd probably say that too. Feel like he he knows they're right. Oh, they're doing it. Who would you choose? Oh, that's like so hard. <laughs> they're all going. Look at him shaking. Oh no. This would be such an impossible choice. No, he doesn't want him to. I mean, if you believe the soul leaves the body, like I would give my body, you could eat me. If you survive, like, I don't know. Like if any therapy could ever heal you, you just have to bargain with yourself and know you did the right thing. No me mires así, coche. Oh, now they're judging each other. Oh, he feels guilt and shame. Los primos Strauch se encargan del trabajo más doloroso, el que nadie quiere hacer. That's tough, man. I mean, I have respect for that guy who'd be able to do it. Así logran contener la locura de los que comen. Oh, I just eat it raw. Encontré algo. Please be food in there. Una radio. A radio. Please work. Los que no comemos seguimos mirando al cielo, esperando una señal. Oh my gosh, it's working! No way! Radios are absolutely amazing. Un poco más a la izquierda. Toma. Oh. ¿Qué es eso? Dale, planeo es más fácil. No, gracias. Oh. No está bien, Pancho. What's happening? I think everyone is so strong for whatever their own morality is. <gasps> no! Oh my god! 66 search and rescue missions? No! Oh no! They're gutted! Oh no! Oh, this is gonna change everything. What devastating news. No one has survived, but they're alive. Oh my God, I can't believe they just missed them. I think because they're just off course. They're not like on the course 
Oh my god, now this is going to drive them crazy. Le pedí que esperara el rescate para nada, pero si puedo pedirles algo más, les pido que coman. Oh my gosh. <coughs> oh, eat or die. Acá lo único que nos queda es la vida, y la tenemos que defender por encima de todo. It's about surviving now. I mean, he's going to have to eat, like he has no choice. Subimos a buscar la cola del avión, sin avisar a nadie, improvisando. I'm scared this is so dangerous. They're going to do it. They have to get it so they can make contact. Oh my gosh. It better be in there. Oh, the guy that got pulled out of the plane. Oh. Oh, his bestie. Don't push it. Oh. They're so desperate to find this battery. Look, it's already getting dark. I guess when you have nothing else to live for, why not? But this is so dangerous. No, you guys have to head back. Oh no, this is going to be a bad night. Oh, the weather up there is awful. No! This is going to be a miracle if they survive and they find this battery. Wow. <gasps> oh my gosh, look at his eye. Wow, that's freezing cold. And I'm a baby when it rains here. Their mountains are so unforgiving. Are they sliding down? Yeah, that's smart to conserve energy. I think we got to be careful we don't crash into stuff. Oh, that guy bailed. <laughs> Be a little bit of fun, a little tobogganing. Come and they're keeping everybody alive. <gasps> ah, no, no, no. It's so unbearable to watch. I can't even believe this, that they are going through this. They need to hike out. You have to. He's been so strong with his convictions this whole time. No one will blame you guys. You just have to be able to forgive yourself and just be so thankful for them for giving you their bodies. Oh, he's still considering it. Oh, I guess you would just pray God would forgive you I and mean, they would forgive you, yeah. No matico más de dos o tres veces. Who's gonna spit it out? Me a tragar. <gasps> oh, that would be so challenging. Posibilidad cada vez más real de no volver a casa. Oh. I think he's right. Oh, this weather. Pero yo voy a ir con él. There's just gonna be a couple of them that, of them that leave. Day 17, fifth day of the storm. <laughs> Good spirits. Mientras una tragedia se desata desde mi hamaca, veo a varios superhéroes sin capa. Estar con ustedes es un regalo de la vida. Oh, wow. Oh, they're getting their morale up. En la montaña la situación es intensa, pero no puedo irme de aquí sin antes escuchar una del reservado Numa. What are you going to say? En, en esta heladísima montaña, donde no camina ni media araña. <laughs> I love how they're still one and they're all together and they're rubbing each other's feet so that their toes don't go cold. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, are they gonna slide? Don't. Avalanche. No, no, no. Please tell me they didn't lose more people. Oh my God, the sound editing. No. They were definitely in a really bad avalanche zone. This is awful. Now everyone's suffocating because they're stuck. Oh my God, oh my God. This is honestly the most awful story I've ever seen. They're completely buried, completely buried. I mean, what else would they have done that was their only shelter? You have to help Jake, everybody. They have time still. Come on, come on. Come on, guys. God, what else do these guys have to endure? 
Oh no. Oh no. No, he can't lose her. Oh. Oh no. Oh no. It's not even just the suffocating, it's like getting hit with the avalanche. Oh no, they're getting hit again. It's avalanche again. Oh, they're gonna have to leave. They're gonna have to get out. Oh fuck. No, not another round two. No. Oh, because oh, they're testing it with a lighter. We lost the guys that were cutting up the bodies for them to eat. Marcelo! No! Marcelo quedó Such sad poetry, what he's saying about these events. They have to be constantly living in fear. Yeah, it could be so much snow. Oh my god. <gasps> His birthday. What a hell of a way to spend your 25th birthday. How are they gonna dig themselves out? Oh, is that what he took off the other guy? It was um, one of the saints. I mean, that's why he took it so he could pray. It's so sad that they lost even more because there was a lot of them that survived. They've really done this tribute to them in a really beautiful way. <sighs> Day 18, two days buried. Their little sigil from their team. El hambre es insoportable. They said that you could eat their bodies though. They gave you permission. Los Strauch consiguieron que la carne sea solo carne. Carne sin nombre. But now you'll know. Pero acá no se puede. Roberto. Para seguir hay que comer, ¿no? Oh. 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 Oh, the sound effects. That's what exactly what it would have sounded like, I bet. Ahora se van a dejar morir. <laughs> Después de todo lo que pasa. You've made it so far. I can't give up now. You can't. The sacrifice wouldn't have been worth it because they would want you to live. That's how I look at it. There's so much suffering for those have, that have survived. <laughs> He's just over this. He's like, we got to get out of here. <laughs> I'd rather try to hike out too. <laughs> it's gonna shatter all over him. <laughs> oh no! Oh no, that's not good. Four days buried, day 20. No, he's still holding on to her. You'd never want to let go. Yes. Yes! Oh my god. He's crawling out of the smallest little space. The strength and the will to live in humans is just insane. It must be the most fresh air you've ever breathed in your life. They're gonna have to hike out of here because there's absolutely no way they're gonna be able to endure this. They can't. They're not gonna be able to survive. That would feel empowering getting out of there and feeling alive after being buried for so many days. Oh my gosh. Are they gonna try to, what are they trying to do? Oh no. I hope his leg doesn't get infected. After all that they've survived, yeah, he you probably would have more faith. I can't believe this guy. I mean, he's not going to be able to hike out. That's the truth. Este es mi cielo. Y yo creo en otro Dios. En el Dios que tiene Roberto en la cabeza cuando viene a curarme las heridas. Oh, wow. He believes in each other and their strength. Cuando corta la carne. Y fito cuando la reparte, sin decirnos a qué amigo perteneció. Y así podamos comerla sin, sin tener que recordar su mirada. Your ideology would change. Your belief structure would just change. Hasta ahora siempre salimos de manera improvisada y no tuvimos éxito. Yeah, they need to plan. They're right. Plan and prepare. What's the plan going to be? I can't believe they're digging this out, but that's their only shelter. What are they talking about? Oh, they had a disagreement of some sort. 
Day 34, the thaw begins. But they're not gonna be able to keep the bodies frozen either. Oh, he's not doing well. Pero vos tenés la mejor pierna del equipo. Tenés que caminar por los demás. Oh my gosh, you're gonna send him out? Oh yeah, because he's this guy. Oh no, but isn't he the youngest? Arturo Nogueira tiene los pulmones encharcados. I just keep seeing their friends die one by one. <sighs> Is he going? Oh, he has all the crosses on him to protect him. Some of them are going, some of them are staying. Somos cuatro voluntarios. Day 36, Expedition East, Argentina. Oh, all in like Adidas Sambas. Their feet must be so cold. Brave men. Oh, his foot is not doing well. <gasps> oh no, oh no. Please tell me you're not gonna have to amputate his leg. No antibiotics. <gasps> what? Just passed out. <gasps> He's not gonna be able to make it. His foot is so badly infected. He better make it back to camp at least. They literally have nothing to treat that with. Probably no energy to say anything. Oh no, is he hallucinating? Cause he's dying? Those guys have to find somebody, they have to. Oh, he held on for so long. Traté de ser siempre lo correcto. Y ahora con la pierna así, soy un inútil. That would just be such a shitty feeling. Pero yo no me podía mover porque tenía los pies aprisionados contra su pecho. Y si hacía fuerza para salir, la iba a hundir más en la nieve. ¿Qué sentido tiene eso, Numa? Can't understand why and how things happen. Abracé a Liliana con toda la fuerza que tenía. Y sentí un amor que no había sentido en toda mi vida. <risa> y me di cuenta que tenía una misión. Que era tomar ese amor que estaba apretando ahí contra mi pecho y llevárselo de vuelta a mis hijos. Tu muerte no fue en vano. Esa herida no te hace un inútil. Wow. That's so powerful. Oh man, that's gotta lift you up, Numa. Oh man, how far did these guys make it now? How would you even know where to go? Did they find the battery? They found it! No le íbamos a encontrar nunca. Se catapultó para adelante. Wow. Estaba todo lleno de valijas desperdigadas, abrigos limpios. Lleno de botellas de ron. Oh my gosh. Cigarettes, oh my gosh. This would be like the biggest jackpot. Chocolate, chocolate. No, oh, he gave him a piece. Oh, the best chocolate you ever had. <laughs> Miracle. Oh God, his whimper. Heroes. They're all heroes. Oh God, heavy. Va a ser más fácil traer la radio para acá. Viste que Roy arregló la radio portátil. Roberto está convencido de que puede hacer funcionar la del avión. Come on, guys. Hay que intentarlo. This is the plan. Oh, they're gonna drag it. They're going back at night. I mean, this is the only thing they can do. This is your only hope. Ojalá pudieras con ellos. This would probably kill you inside because you'd want to be with them. It has to work. This is literally your only hope. Oh, wow. Oh my God, what a sight. That would have been an incredible sight. <laughs> oh my gosh. Just get a message out there somewhere, somehow. It will work. It has to work. ¿Qué hacemos? Se sale a caminar de vuelta. Hacia el oeste, a Chile. Hola. Oh my God. You just don't want to get your hopes up, right? Because you've been let down so many times. Hola keep sending out an SOS. The daytime is their only refuge because you get the warmth of the sun. Perdemos un poquito más de vida. Oh, saw the infection. Las raciones de comida no alcanzan y saqueamos los huesos. Lo que al principio parecía impensable, 
se convirtió en habitual. Después dejamos de darle importancia. Ah, ah. Toma, come un poco. Tiene que comer, Numa. He probably doesn't have the energy to eat. Mitad, mitad. No te rindas ahora. No me estoy rindiendo, Pancho. Me estoy muriendo. Oh, no. He knows his infection's bad. Tengo 25 años, Pancho. Una vida por delante. Me queda todo por hacer. Quiero bailar. Vos nunca bailas. Quiero hacer. Quiero reír. Quiero llorar. Llorar. No puedo. Dale, llora. No. <risa> llora conmigo. Y te reís. If you survived, your whole outlook on life would be so different. God, you'd appreciate so much. Oh my gosh. So many beautiful scenes in this movie. They're literally surviving the impossible. ¿Qué es eso? Es impermeable. <gasps> oh, it's waterproof. Come on. Oh, oh. <laughs> It'd be so frustrating and infuriating. Don't give up, guys. As of today, November 29, 1972, there are 17 more survivors up above. You're in the Uruguayan plane that crashed in the mountains. Wow. Yes, leave every message you can leave in case that is found. I hope that message got out. I hope someone heard that. Someone had to have heard that message from him. No funcionó lo de la radio. It did, though, for a minute. It worked. Mejor hagamos un sobre de dormir. Con un sobre podemos soportar la noche. Wow, that's smart. ¿Cuándo salimos, Roberto? Oh, he's hurting. Feel like he's starting to not believe anymore. En cuanto esté sobre listo. Yes. Apareció el avión Fairchild 571 de la Fuerza Aérea Uruguaya con 40 pasajeros y 5 tripulantes. Come on. Come on. Retomará la búsqueda en la cordillera de los Andes. Yes. Yes. But they didn't get the message. ¿Y vos todavía crees que piensan que estamos vivos? Estamos vivos. No, I don't think they will. Mira que acá no salimos solo rezando. You guys have to do something. You... What? Maybe they'll have a different plan and they'll search more of the area. There's a hawk? This is a good sign, isn't it? Chocho, mirame acá para una fotito. Oh, because he still has his camera. Oh, oh my gosh, I can't believe it. Tintin se empeña en sacar fotografías. He should take pictures. They're going to show these at the end, I bet. Como si tomara recuerdos de un viaje que tiene fecha de regreso. Oh, they're covering the bones and the bodies. Would you want to remember this? Tal vez sean para nuestras familias. ¿Qué nos pasó? ¿Quiénes fuimos a la montaña? You're survivors in the mountains. Quiero que sepas que tenés mi permiso. You're gonna make it. They're gonna come get you guys. They're gonna find you. Man. He's had much contemplation. You would make peace. You'd have to. I think he's gonna make it though. They're gonna come. They're trying to clean his wounds with alcohol. He's smart, brave. Young people, they're so strong. <gasps> They've still been such a great team together. No, no. Morí el 11 de diciembre de 1972. God, he made it so long. I just, I can't believe it. That damn infection got him. Oh, so many of them must have been so close. But I just still don't know how long it's going to be before they get found. Is it the list of all the names of the people? There is no greater love than to give one's life for friends. Salimos <laughs> mañana. Oh, I'm packing up some, some food <laughs> so they can make it out. They can't keep losing each other. They can't. Mucha suerte, Roberto. You can do it, buddy. You guys can do it. Oh, no, ma. <laughs> Keep bringing it in. Pueden usar los cuerpos de mi mamá y de Susi. Oh, he's given them permission. I honestly like have so much respect for all these people. <laughs> wow, they've made snowshoes. <sighs> Now, what if a plane comes and then those guys are left out there? Day 61, Expedition West, Chile. Really needed tissues for this movie. Wow. And to do this without gear. 
uh, I mean, the gear in the 70s compared to now that we have, but like they literally have nothing. It's everything's makeshift. Oh, and to survive, it's just incredible. To watch them do this just makes you feel like anything in life is possible, you know? What do you see? Tell me you see something, please. Please, God. He looks amazed. These mountains would be etched into your mind and your memory forever. What is it? <gasps> please, please. Come on, no, no more snow. More mountains. Oh, devastating. It's so vast. That would be something that would be hard to make peace with. What's the reality of where they are? <laughs> Yep. Oh, no, don't give up. <laughs> that is true. Yes, can't turn back now. <laughs> A long time. Walk with him. Go, push forward. <laughs> oh, he's rooting. He's finding his path. Oh, it's only two of them going. Oh, that's a smart plan. Less mouths to feed. It's good bringing hope to them as well. They're going to make it. They're gonna make a really good team out there. I just know it. You would just have to pick like a point and get there and just like keep going and keep going. It's just so dangerous. <laughs> like, honestly, like you'd probably never want to climb a mountain ever again. Or you'd maybe like going to the mountains. I don't know what your mindset would be after, but small goals, small goals. That's the only thing that can keep pushing you forward. This would just be so grueling, so tiring. And like one misstep in your toast. I just worry about all the crevasses. How do you get the strength to do this? Just the mentality you have to hold. Imagine. A valley. Yes, this is what he said. This movie score and editing and the cinematography has just been absolutely incredible. The story is just so unimaginable. Oh, he's got rugby cleats. Oh, he looked like he had so much gratitude for his friend. He's checking it to make sure it's not gone off. Because that would be terrible. Oh no, is the food gone bad? They're able to make a little bit of a fire. No. No, 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 no. Hold on, buddy. Hold on, buddy. <gasps> Fresh water! God, that'd be the best water you'd ever drink in your entire life. You can make it through this. Just, yeah, get the water into your system. It's like the holy grail. Green grass. What do you see? Oh, something that's not human. A lizard. What do you see? <gasps> Thank God they speak the same language. Oh my God, but he's so far across the river. Sending a message. Oh God. Oh God. What does it say? I'm from. Oh, he sent him a piece of paper. Soy uruguayo. En el avión quedaron 14 personas heridas. They are not gonna believe this. This man. It'll be the most beautiful sight you'd ever see. Oh, call on the rescue team. Are they gonna think it's impossible to save them? Oh wow, it's so beautiful. Oh my gosh. Don't overeat. <laughs> you don't want to get too sick. This would be the best food ever. It was worth the walk. It was worth the trek. Please get be able to get your friends. Oh no, it's reporters. No. Did you guys send out a plane? Oh, but they're gonna get word on the radio. Ave Maria. What a song. He knows. 71 days. Are they going to show them where they are? 
Please show them where they are. The Chilean Air Force, day 71, December 22nd. They're going to be home for Christmas. Oh my God. <laughs> they want to look good for getting picked up. <laughs> taking a little memory home with him. Oh God, look at the bones. Oh my gosh. They're packing up everything to take home to everyone's families. Now that's the rest of the food. Oh, that's so beautiful. For these families, it would be such a miracle. Do they see it? Do they see it? It's so beautiful that they they knew and so they could get ready for them to come. <laughs> wow. Everyone be careful now. <laughs> careful with the helicopter. What pure joy would this be? Oh my god. Wow. Wow, that plane was their home for so long. I hope everyone forgave them and understood that they had to do what they had to do to survive. What a shock for the people and the families and the whole world to know that they survived. You would think that like anything would be possible. Oh, it's because it has all the stuff in it. But the weight, he really stood his ground there. He needed to take all that stuff back for everybody. Whoa! Goodbye. Thank you to everybody. Oh, the rugby. Oh my god. El 22 de diciembre de 1972, 16 sobrevivientes regresaron de los Andes. Hoy mi voz suena con sus palabras. Mm. Cuenta que todos fuimos fundamentales. They really did. Esta es nuestra historia. Wow. Well, their families. Oh, you just feel so sad for everyone that didn't make it, you know, and their families. Oh. I wonder how hard that would, any guilt or anything would be to carry after, you know? It'd be hard to survive that and come back to society. That'd be another sight. Oh, she's like, bless my baby. <laughs> he was staring at her. <laughs> oh, he's so tiny. So emaciated. He would need so much help to recover. wonder if he'd had survivor's guilt. Wow. <laughs> yeah, I've been through a lot. <sighs> An egg, the exit. Oh, it's kind of a beautiful thing to take with you. ¿Qué sentido tiene? I don't know. I think it just happened. And they made it. Ustedes son la respuesta. Oh. Sigan cuidándose unos a otros. Look at them all together. It's so beautiful. Y cuéntenle a todos lo que hicimos en la montaña. Oh. Wow. Wow, the actors in this are absolutely incredible. This film was so well done. It was so beautifully done. I mean, it's so tragic. I think these people were incredibly tough to make the decision the only choice that they had to survive and to um, survive off of the flesh and the meat of the deceased, their loved ones. I think that is so sad. I, I don't know how they were able to like will themselves to do that. Some of these guys just seem like they were able to almost like disassociate or just know that they had to do it to survive. And I find that that is extremely powerful because I don't know how people could do it. I don't. I'm kind of of the mentality of like, if I died, I'd want them to eat me. So I, I would want to save my friends. And so I think that would maybe give you a little bit more peace knowing that like your friends and your loved ones helped you and they would probably want that the whole time. That's what I'm thinking. That's the whole time you're thinking that you're, to me, you're not thinking about cannibalism because it wasn't a, a choice that they would have made. It was literally life or death. I feel like they were very thoughtful about it. They seemed religious and spiritual and they seemed very thankful and they did it in a very careful, thoughtful way. But to me, this is a story about survival and it is such a 
incredible story. I want to go watch interviews. I want to see what they did. I want to see if like they've remained doctors and what they did with their lives. And I'm, I'm really interested to follow up with that. I don't remember anything from the movie Alive at all. I do not think that they would have been rescued that fast with what I know about helicopters and stuff and, and search and rescue. So um, I wonder how long it actually took to find them and get them out of the the Andes. Wow, that movie, it was incredibly powerful. What a story. I cannot believe what these people had to go through. And I just send them all so much love. Thank you guys so much for watching with me. If you guys love movies, don't forget to hit that subscribe button, hit the like, and I'll see you guys in the next reaction video. Ciao.